Winter will be a difficult time for South Africans. While ESCOM is planning to do less maintenance during the next few months to bolster energy supply, the system is very volatile and not stable. Expert Alvi Lester says, however, while there's some fear mongering around a total grid collapse, it's not very likely. I think the efforts by ESCOM to try and reduce uh, load shedding levels are, are great. Uh, however, um, they've not yet uh, been effective. I think we still need to see the effect of those. I think if you look at the outlook, there's huge risk of increased uh, levels of load shedding uh, because the EAF has not improved and that the demand will certainly increase in the winter. And I think it's very likely that we will find ourselves uh, going into the winter um, uh, stage eight. And I think the risk of a total blackout is extremely low, uh, but this risk is increased. Uh, you know, we will see increased stages of load shedding to avert a blackout. The Western Cape government says partnering with the private sector and other entities is vital to building energy resilience in the province. Last year, Ryan Mattel Danel Munition launched a major renewable energy project. In a physical process, water is split into oxygen and hydrogen, with the derived hydrogen used as a storage system. Through the use of renewable energy to achieve this, the hydrogen is deemed green. The company has a 5,500 hectare solar farm and wants to become an energy supplier. We just started um, to, to secure ourselves with 25 megawatt. Uh, on top of this, we will feed into the grid as a supplier. Um, so, and then not my vision, my target is that you all can, can go, like you do it in Europe, for example, at, at, at one stage, not tomorrow, but one stage you can go into your app your electricity app and you can choose your energy supplier where you want to buy your, your energy and then you can go to Rheinmetall and you, you buy Rheinmetall uh, uh, green renewable energy uh, uh, electricity. Helmson says when its 5 megawatt plant is ready in the coming weeks, it will be off the grid. He says in the months following, it will be able to assist municipalities. Mariska Boerta, SABC News, Cape Town.